Good evening. The government will devote about 30 billion United States dollars to climate change mitigation and adaptation measures, namely net zero electricity generation, saving energy in buildings, promoting green transport and waste reduction. Our sources of carbon emissions come mainly from power generation, which accounts for two-thirds of our carbon emissions. Buildings in particular, accounting for about 90% of all electricity generated in Hong Kong. Transport comes second, accounting for about 19%, and waste 8%. The Hong Kong SAR government is therefore taking four major decarbonization strategies to address these sources of emission. The first, of course, is to achieve net zero electricity generation. Second, saving energy in buildings. Third, green transport. Finally, waste reduction. The latest addition announced by the chief executive in his policy address this year is the formulation of a strategy on hydrogen development in early next year. In the next 15 to 20 years, the Hong Kong SAR government will need to devote about 30 billion US dollars to implement the above mentioned measures. The Cross-Boundary Public Services Initiative, a joint effort with the Guangdong Provincial Government to develop the Digital Bay Area, will enable enterprises and the public to enjoy convenient cross-boundary services. We have recently launched the Cross-Boundary Public Services Initiative. It is our joint effort with the Guangdong Provincial Government in developing the digital Bay Area. It will enable enterprises and the public in both places to enjoy simple and convenient cross-boundary services. It also facilitates the provision of public services and investments in the GBA from taxation and company registration to talent admission and elderly services. Soon, Self-service kiosks will be set up in Hong Kong and Guangdong province, respectively, for the convenience of local residents. Our target is to roll out the Hong Kong self-service kiosk in Guangzhou by the first quarter of 2024 and gradually cover all nine mainland cities in the GBA. That's the news update.